What is going on guys? It's Tabby Cats here. Finally back with another video. I know I haven't uploaded since last month. I've been very, very busy going through some things personally with some of my uh, conditions, anxiety, uh, stuff like that. But I am back now. Um, so since I'm staying home, I figured I would go ahead and make another video for you guys. I know a while back I told you I had mounted the Simon. Well, first, let me start the video saying I hope everyone's staying safe and doing good. Okay, so now to the video. Um, I know I told you I mounted the Simon on the desk mount uh, and moved the 2 gig over here, but that the 2 gig was not ready to go yet. Well, now it is. I have a rear door sensor. So, R for rear. As you can see, because of the spacing, I used hot glue and I put the magnet and the sensor into different uh, ways. Uh, it had to be that way. As you can see, the ADT technician, when he installed the DSC, he had to do the earth magnet thing, same as the DSC contact. The front door is the same um, as how I had to do the two gig contact. This is from an old alarm, and this is from an old alarm. Uh, so let's go ahead and go check out one of the other components of the two gig. That's my kitty cat. Old Faith, you probably remember her from a few videos. Um, so I have a key fob here, and I just want to go over some basic instructions uh, on how to use the fob. So to arm to a way, you push and hold the little guy walking out the door. Arming away. Exit now. To disarm, you just hold the unlock button. System disarmed. Ready to arm. This button right here is not enabled, this, but this is like if you have lighting, automatic lights or something like that hooked to the system through like alarm.com or something. You can see on the back, it's uh, K1, so key fob one. Stay, you go. Arming stay. Disarm, same. System disarmed. Ready to arm. Now, maybe loud for a second. I'm going to show you guys the panic feature. Please turn down your volume right now, but still up to where you can hear it. To activate an audible panic alarm, push and hold. Alarm. Key fob. One. System disarmed. Ready to arm. Now you may be asking why I didn't start off with the key fob. So here's the thing. If you activate the panic alarm from the fob, you cannot shut the fob's panic alarm off with the disarm button. You must enter your code. So we're going to try the other two panics. To access the panics on the 2 gig panel, if it was asleep, you see this white cross. You hit this. I do not have the medical button enabled because that's not really going to do anything until we get a dialer. Panic and fire, so to hold, to scare someone away, hold panic. Police. System disarmed. Ready to arm. To activate fire, to evacuate everyone, push and hold fire. Fire. System disarmed. Ready to arm. So they silenced that with the code. Now I'm going to show you the uh, burglar alarm portion, so just for the sake of time, we're going to arm to away and do a, uh, actually let's go ahead and do stay and we'll do an instant for the back door. Arming stay. So it's going to count down and I will be back when it's done counting down. System armed stay. So it's on staying out, and we're going to go ahead and trip the back door. Alarm, clear, door. System disarmed. Ready to arm. So I canceled the alarm. So now I'm going to show you guys how to arm and disarm using the panel. To arm, go security, arm, do either away or stay. You also have an option for silent exit and entry delay. 
So let's do away. Arming away. Exit now. You leave the building. When you return home and then should the starts hit disarm and enter your four digit code. System disarmed. Ready to arm. So to arm stay, same way. Tap to wake it up. Security. Arm. Arming stay. To disarm when you get up in the morning, go back to security, push disarm, enter your four digit code. System disarmed. Ready to arm. So to view troubles, if you have a trouble condition, you push security and the yellow triangle. The front door does have a low battery, but I already acknowledged it. So no other troubles. So up here, this is, shows you the uh, AC status. For a whole system status, time, date, security menu, status, plus status. System disarmed. Low battery. Front door. Back. We're going to hit home button. Put the keypad manually to sleep. Do that. <clears throat> to access the menu and do bypass and all that, security menu, toolbox, your four digit code. So you got code management, system history, system tests, you can test individual sensors, bypass sensors, brightness and volume, oops, chime setup, backlight timeout, which is just how long before it goes dark after no activity. Clean the screen, it'll give you a few seconds to clean it without activating anything. Calibrate touch screen, if it starts acting wonky, set time, set date. Version is like if you needed the software info. And that's for, if, oops. The cell phone and telephone tester for if you have a dialer, installer toolbox, enter your uh, installer code. And system configuration, restore to default, radio status, it's red because I don't have a dialer yet, walk test, uh, disable the sounder for a few minutes if you're working on it. Image sensors for if you have those, whoever had this system before had them. So when I click it, it does nothing. Just to exit out of the whole menu and just push home. Put the panel manually to sleep. Just do that. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'm glad I got to do another video finally. I've missed uh, seeing you guys. Uh, I believe my last video was of the wise cameras. Uh, yeah, and we still have those. They're still great. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. And I hope you enjoyed this one as well. I will be trying to upload a lot more in the coming weeks. However, I am trying to finish up some schooling. So I'm not sure if I'll be able to. But until I see you next time, I hope you enjoyed. And uh, feel free to please like, comment, subscribe, and share it with your friends. Thank you, and uh, there'll definitely be more to come with the 2 gigs, so make sure you stay tuned for that. I have a few surprises on the way now. I will talk to you guys soon. Bye. Stay safe. Be blessed.